Okay, so you're here at PAX South because you're marketing what specifically here? We were talking about Intel RealSense technology. We were actually brought it to PAX South last year and we had a couple of kind of starter experiences. We've really upped our game this year. I'd love to show you what we're doing. Yeah, definitely, because I was sort of walking around uh, the main hall and then stopped when I saw this. People are like, you're literally walking around uh, with the Surface, right? Is this a, no, no, this is an HP tablet. That's right. And, uh, and what is it specifically that you're doing here? Great, so this is an HP Spectre X2 tablet and uh, it has a 3D camera, an Intel RealSense 3D camera built into the back. So in conjunction with the RealSense camera and the software that's enabled, it sees 3D. We're able to do a 3D scan of somebody's entire head or body. So here's an example, a great example of a full body scan, right? Or a head scan. And these are just people that are just walking up to the booth, waiting in line, sitting down, and it's just they're just asking for this stuff, right? That's right. That's right. And that's so, so cool. So what I'm going to do then is package up the files uh, the exports as, a, as an industry standard format. Um, I will email them the files and the instructions for how to process those files so they can mod themselves into their favorite games like Fallout 4, Skyrim, GTA 5, FIFA 15, Arma 3, and a lot of others are on the way being enabled for this capability. And how long was this really in development? I mean, it, this is out as of December, is that right? This rear-facing camera for scanning objects and, and, and people just hit the market with this HP Spectre X2 in December. Uh, we made a big splash about it at the Consumer Electronics Show uh, last month, um, but this is really a big end user, real people experience sort of thing that we're bringing it out. Gotcha. And uh, so what has been the, the overall feedback? Are people happy with how they're looking here? And then you're also showing uh, live demonstrations of those models right here in Skyrim and in Fallout 4, right? That, that's right. So uh, I, I, before the show, I, I had a scan of myself and, and added my mod into uh, uh, Skyrim there. Uh, and folks have been playing as me all day. It's a little creepy, especially when I die. But yeah, you're, you're standing just a few feet away. <laughs> yeah, right, right. Um, and uh, my colleague Beth over here, she's an expert in Fallout modding. She Not only did she put her face in, she's playing Fallout 4 as herself, but she also did some custom clothing and put the Intel logo in. It's been really great. Yeah. So that's that's pretty cool. And like, uh, and how is the is how is is it reliable? Is it easy to use? Or is it literally physically just walking around somebody in that space? And it's just how, how long does that take? Well, so it's taking about three or four minutes to scan a person. Um, you know, we we're still because this is a relatively new experience. We're still kind of tweaking around with the lighting and uh, the environment. Um, but the lighting is the biggest challenge. If, if you have the lighting right, then it is just a matter of walking around the person once or twice, um, getting under the chin and behind the ears, just like mom told you to take a bath, and, uh, and that's it. And, and then the process of creating the mod, it's done through a cloud service called Uranium. Um, they're in public beta right now, and you upload the 3D model from the, the output of the RealSense camera into Uranium's cloud service and it creates the mod for you, installs it on your system, and you pop into your game and you choose your character and you're ready to go play. So it's it's sort of a unified mod tool for all these different games? Okay, so if you've never modded anything before in your life, it's pretty straightforward, correct? It's pretty straightforward, absolutely. All right, I'll take your word for it and I'll definitely check it out. So. I, 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 I put a little... Uh, a demo video online, so everybody that gets a scan will also get a link to that video. Oh, and is that available on YouTube? Yeah, like, it, is. it sure is. Okay, well, thanks again, Mike. Appreciate yeah, you. you. I, I'm, I'm going to scan myself. I'm going to wait in line to, so I can do it myself. Sounds good. Yeah. All right, thank you. <laughs> yeah. Thanks.